living in a group means you need to feed many mouths. This final experiment will test the strategy behind what a lion is perhaps most famous for, hunting. How do lions hunt? How do they choose their prey? Do they categorize? Do they base their decisions on how many individuals are with them? What is going on in a lion hunting party? Now, Natalia is using some unusual props to find out. Something that has never been attempted before. Here or there might work, yeah. yeah. But how are the lions going to react to the new menu? Should we put some grass here for him to eat? <laughs> In case he gets hungry while yeah, he's waiting there. to be eaten by the lion? There we go. It'll make it more convincing for the lion. Okay. Will they even recognize the cutouts as prey? So the idea is, if you're a single lion hunting, then you're going to want to go for the easy prey, because there's just one of you. So you might choose, say, the warthog or the impala. Whereas if you have a partner with you, then you can probably capture something more difficult. First to face the cutouts is lioness Meg. But what will she make of the two-dimensional menu? As predicted, Meg chose the smallest and easiest animal. You must be pleased with that. That was amazing. Yeah, sure. yeah. Did you see her? So she checked him when you were a little ways off. Yeah. You saw her head come up and she kind of, oh, what's, what are but those? But she went, she went for the impala, which was yeah, what she I did. think you're hoping. Yeah, she yeah. went for one of the smaller ones, which is what we would expect to happen with yeah. just a single female. So I think um, to up the ante, one would want to now bring out three lions Absolutely. Yeah. yeah and perhaps a male as well there's going to be a lot of meat there so the risk might be worth it when you have kind of safety in numbers finally three lions Vietzi, Ginny and Livy head out on the hunt with strength in numbers the theory predicts they'll target the biggest prey they lock onto the buffalo but then the wind changes and the buffalo disappears. So the trio simply set their sights on something else. They all went for the they impala. They all went for the impala. Because <laughs> it's the tastiest meat out there. I guess. Have you ever had impala? It's really tasty. Is <laughs> it? Yeah. Despite taking down the impala, Vietzi and the females did choose the buffalo first. But Vietzi isn't quite finished exploring all the potential prey options. Kevin. Yeah. Hey, Kevin. <laughs> Move your fingers. It's all about risk versus reward. The lions are choosing prey exactly as scientists have predicted, but haven't been able to test until now. Starting this, I didn't even know if the cutouts would work. Would they recognize two-dimensional objects as prey species, and clearly they do. It's been some really amazing um, behavior that we've been observing that I did not think we would get, honestly. I didn't know what to expect, but I didn't expect it to go this well. It gives us a way to actually test that now, so we can do this with lots of male-female pairs and finally see, okay, if you're with a male, how does your behavior change versus with, if you're just with a female partner? 